Coiva is the largest island in the Pacific Ocean in Central America and is characterized by important and unique ecosystems such as mangrove, coral reef and primary forest. These fragile, pristine ecosystems combine to produce landscapes of incomparable beauty that are home to an exceptionally high level of endemism for mammals, birds and plants. We team up with the Institute for Wildlife Studies and travel to Coiva to initiate our wildlife surveillance project. After a short ride, we encounter a giant manta ray feeding close to the water surface. After two hours, we arrive to Coiva Station to get ready to start our project. Because of habitat loss and fragmentation in other areas of Panama, Coiva is one of the last major refuge for rare and endangered species of tropical America. On day one, we visit the area of Santa Cruz and set up 10 remote cameras along the trail to record photos and estimate the abundance and distribution of animals in this area. Studying the ecology and distributions of mammals in Coiva is essential to their conservation, not only in Panama, but also for maintaining population strongholds and habitats, which allow genetic diversity to persist among regional populations. On our way back home, we encounter a number of endangered animals, including capuchin monkeys, we also saw the endemic Coiva Aguti roaming around our camping area. The next day we headed to Cerro X, also known as Viper Hill. Before placing the first camera, we spotted an endemic brown back doe. All cameras were affixed to trees at 30 to 60 centimeters above the ground and programmed to allow a photo to be recorded every five minutes. Our cameras were placed strategically in order to obtain images of wild animals. Red brocket deer and white-tailed deer are easily spot all around Coiva. We also saw an American crocodile resident in this region. The following day we started early we saw a troop of endemic howler monkeys, only found in Coiva. It was very hot and we all were extremely tired from trekking through the jungle, but we managed to set up more cameras. On our last day, we headed to Playa Hermosa, a relatively unexplored and isolated place. It was not easy to arrive to the beach, Trekking was long and difficult. We walked for three hours to reach our study area before setting up the last camera. This research will collect essential information for conservation efforts of Coiva and provide data to initiate a future long term study to understand animals' movements and habitat use in this part. This study will also provide opportunities to involve and educate local people and Coiva visitors on wildlife conservation and develop media products for promoting the conservation of this incredible place. Mm -hmm.